Good day everyone! On today's video, we're going to discuss about the sewage water treatment plant. This is our sewage water treatment plant and we discovered that there is a small problem on the alarm. But before I proceed to that problem, I would like to discuss briefly about the sewage water treatment plant for the viewers that are not familiar into this equipment. Here is the sample drawing of a sewage water treatment plant. It is vessel equipment used to remove any pollutant from sewage water before releasing it from the vessel to the sea. All water from galley, toilet, shower room will go to sewage water treatment plant to make it clean before discharging it from the vessel to the sea to avoid any marine pollution. It have three main chamber. First is the aeration chamber, second is the settling chamber, third is the chlorination chamber where the clean or treated water will be ready to discharge from the vessel to the sea automatically by means of discharge pump motor. Now let's go back to the alarm that I mentioned before. Sewage water treatment plant have two alarms. One is the sewage water treatment plant plant high level alarm and the number two is the sewage water treatment failure. The sewage high level alarm is located in last chamber, the chlorination chamber while the sewage failure is located inside the panel when the breaker trip off. This is the sewage high level alarm inside the chlorination chamber. As you can see, there is a three floater. The top floater is the sewage high level alarm and the next one or in the middle is the motor start for the discharge pump and the bottom is the motor stop for the discharge pump. Mostly, we check and clean all three floaters, but now we just only test the high level alarm. There is alarm, but in ECR, it shows sewage treatment plant failure. The sewage treatment plant failure is activated, but it's supposed to be the sewage treatment plant high level alarm. On this moment, I got an idea what is the problem, but I need to test the other alarm. This is the sewage water treatment plant electrical panel. To test the other alarm, just only switch off all the breaker. And now I got an alarm of sewage water treatment plant high level. I noticed the new wiring inside the panel, only for the two alarm, that could be interchanged during the rewiring. What we're going to do is to swap the two set of alarm signal. If 
if you were going to test the voltage across this tool wire you will get 24 volts DC after swapping the two alarms now we're going to test the sewage water treatment plant failure alarm is ok and correct now we're going to test the sewage high level alarm And now the two alarms is okay. My question is, why they said the sewage high level alarm is not working? It's because the sewage high level alarm has 30 seconds delay before activation. And that alarm was connected before in the breaker so you need to switch off the breaker for 30 seconds to get the high level alarm i hope you learn on this video thank you for watching keep safe everyone